Hey guys, this is Ray with DRP Motorsports and welcome back one last time with our 2019 uh, twin turbo Mustang here on the chassis dyno in the shop. Uh, we're calling it done. We wrapped up everything as far as tuning it on the dyno and seeing what kind of power we could get out of it. Uh, last time we done a video, we showed you it made a little over a thousand wheel horsepower at 19 pounds of boost. And we went ahead and went as high as 21 PSI boost and uh, show you what we did. Uh, Air's really good today, so I'll show you what it did uncorrected, which is what it actually made with no corrections uh, for standard weather conditions. So putting out 1,102 horsepower, 887 on the torque. Um, like I said, those are uncorrected numbers, meaning that's actually what it put to the wheels on the dyno when we made that last pull. So 21 PSI, 1,100 wheel horsepower, but you can see there's a big dip up here at the top and what we run into, I could hear it too. It's uh, started to float the valves a little bit, got a little bit of misfire. I did check my plugs, put new plugs in it, gapped them down, that still didn't make any difference. So I'm pretty confident that we just simply reached the uh, the limit of the uh, valve springs in this engine. So, uh, you know, is it worth changing out the valve springs in this engine? No, it's not worth the trouble. So, I mean, 1100 wheel horsepower is a plenty. And all we got to do is just make sure we're shifting this thing around 7,000 RPMs and it won't be a problem. So we're really happy about this Hellion twin turbo kit. Remember, these are 62, 62 Hellion turbos on this car. So, you know, these are the smaller turbos. They spool quick and still make as enough airflow on this engine to put out 1,100 horsepower at the wheels. So really tickled about that, guys. So if you have any more questions, hit us up. And we'll try to answer them. But as always, thanks again. God bless each and every one of you. And we'll see you again soon.